BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by... I want to retire knowing we did it right. We want... To know that it's been worth something. It's worth everything. Be intentional about your worth. Farmers National Bank Wealth Management. Um, when I realized that the, the chambers around us were having some new directors, I always invite them to our annual dinner, and both James and Alex came. They, my mom was sitting with them, singing to them, being her, my mom as she is, and we just started having these great conversations, and we started to meet every few months because we wanted to continue those conversations about how we can work better together. We have a lot of similar issues, but maybe we work together and problem solve answers together too. And conversations is a big part of what this event today is about. Yeah, you know what, there's wonderful breakout sessions, there's all kind of event, vendor room events going, but you know what's happening? It's the sidebar conversations of people from Mercer County, Lawrence County, Youngstown, Warren, where we just know we can talk, we don't have to worry about all these like imaginary borders in our head. You know, like, this is we can just have these conversations and start to realize that we can work together, collaborate, regionalize, you know, it's, it's really exciting. Sheriff, what's the main thing you want to see coming out of this today? Oh, um, I want to see, you know, obviously collaboration, uh, that's wonderful, collaborative efforts. But I also want to see people start to redefine themselves and quit, you know, the, the get, get rid of some of these silos. And so that now we can start to see ourselves as one or one bigger region. We have a lot more power than we realize. You know, 2020 elections coming up, all they write about is who's going to win the Rust Belt. Well, if they see our power, we need to see our power, and we haven't. I think we need, this is going to help everyone see that we're so much stronger together and we have a lot more power than people realize. You talked about reclaiming the Rust Belt name. Why is that important? Because I think it's, for some people the term Rust Belt is pejorative. This idea that it's like, oh, it's the Rust Belt. Yeah, and, and that's, I don't think, accurate. I mean, sure, a lot of these communities have challenges, but I think challenges also create a unique set of opportunities for revitalization, to be creative, and to do things in a different way that for me, I think are stimulating and exciting. And that's what I chose to make my professional career into. And I try to hold that out there as an example for others that are like-minded, like that was in this room today. Now, you talked about a program that uh, you're atten attempting to get off the ground in Pennsylvania, Restore PA. Restore PA is this idea that Pennsylvania should join every other state in the union that charges an extraction tax on our natural gas. And it's not a wild and crazy idea. It's it's state like ruby red states like Oklahoma and Texas and others routinely apply. In fact, Texas is, is would be higher than what we proposed. And these investments are critical in communities like the Sharon area or Newcastle to help with blight, to help with infrastructure, to help with all kinds of other issues that there isn't a line around the block unless you've got a, a rich uncle that, that are, are going to pay for these things. Now you talked about visiting, uh, crossing the border and visiting Youngstown with someone who's very familiar, we're very familiar with there, Phil Kidd. Uh, yeah, I mean, because that's, I, I was doing this 13 years ago, I was reaching out and what I saw in Youngstown was a, a great community that had a lot of raw talent and resources and the ability to buy a beautiful home for forty or fifty thousand dollars and and I, I saw and see the potential there and, the, and I would rather spend my career working in places like that than already gilding the lily in a place that is hyper gentrified and the average home is eight hundred thousand dollars you know I'll always be a Rust Belt guy and I think uh, I think Rust Belt for me anyway means creativity opportunity and a chance to reinvent businessjournaldaily.com three minutes with is brought to you by I want to retire knowing we did it right we want to know that it's been worth something it's worth everything be intentional about your worth farmers national bank wealth management